Hello, Team Aries. It's Caroline with Empire 333. I hope you're all well and safe. Happy 2024. But you will hear this whenever you're supposed to watch this, right? Um, Aries, you're going to get some really good news, okay? This is your love tarot, but you're going to get some good news. I don't know if it has to do with love, but there is some good news you've been waiting for that is coming in, okay? Um... And it's like you're going to jump at this. Whatever it is, it's really good news. I'm happy for you. Anyways, let's see what's coming in for you when it has to do with love, romance, what you need to know right now. All right. Ooh. All right. Justice. Libra energy. The high priestess. And the six of swords. Keep going? All right. I'll keep going. We got Scorpio. Can't say that word. You know what card that is? Okay. This is interesting. Somebody's coming back. Aries. Some of you are like, who the heck is this? Someone's coming back. I don't know who this is. Let me know in the comments. This is somebody from the past. This is somebody you disconnected from or they disconnected from you. This is somebody who is was like mysterious to you. Maybe they were like an, eni an enigma, okay? This person you definitely have shared a past lifetime with. This is soulmate energy. And this person, whoever they are, you feel like they kept secrets from you. Okay, whoever this person is, that is coming in, that is coming back. Okay, this is somebody you know. This is not somebody new. Okay. Aries, I know some of you will be happy about that. Some of you will not. But this is someone you know. This is somebody, Aries, that you couldn't, like, you couldn't understand some parts of them. You couldn't, like, grasp the depths of this person, okay? Um, let's see. What do they want? Because we have the Empress energy here, Aries. So what this is telling me is that somebody wants a new beginning with you. Okay? Somebody wants a new beginning with you. So let's see. What does this person want? What are their intentions? Wow. The Ace of Pentacles. They want another chance with you. Two of Cups and Ace of Swords. Wow. Okay, like this person is coming in bold. Who is this Aries? Who is this person? I just heard some cussing right now. Some of you Aries are really mad because you think this is a certain person. I could feel you. Okay. But this is somebody who there was reciprocated feelings towards, okay? This is the Two of Cups. This is someone who you were like, this is my soulmate. This is my person. You know, I just feel like very um, spiritual connection with this person. I know that their feelings are there. I know that there's something that brings us together. It's that kind of energy. And this person is going to reach out to you. Okay. What do they want to say to Aries? Let's get, let's deep dive in Aries. What do they want Aries? What are they going to say to Aries? This is so clear. Like I have, oh my God, this is clear as day. Wow, the star card. Mm. 
Wow. This is someone, Aries, I don't know how many times you've seen this person, okay, in your life, but you always had a good time with this person. Like, they know how to have a good time. You know how to have a good time. Like I don't know. Something is um, when you're together with this person. And this person could have ghosted you, Aries. Okay, they could have just stopped talking to you. We've got hermit energy here. Um, and yeah, they're going to reach out to you. This person is going to message you. You know what? This person, you are their f wish fulfillment. What else do you want? Okay, what's blocking this connection? Ooh, Ten of Pentacles. So what I'm getting, Aries, is that there is something... Um, there is something in the past between you two. Maybe this person didn't want a long-term commitment or that their, their idea of commitment was different than yours. But I do see that. Oh, the other thing also, thank you, spirit. Like there, too much information coming through. The other thing is, you always felt this person was hiding something. You had your suspicions like what is what's going on with this person? Where are they? What are they doing? Or you always felt like they're hiding something from you. This person was very mysterious. Okay. Um what was I going to look into? Okay. Ooh, this is crazy. The Wheel of Fortune with Judgment. The number 30 could be significant. The number 1010 10 could be significant. You might be seeing that. So... Aries, you might have given up on this connection, but this person always knew that you were fated to get back together, okay? I'm going to see why this person had an issue with the Ten of Pentacles in the past. Has it changed? What do they think about the Ten of Pentacles with Aries? What do they think about the Ten of Pentacles with Aries? Okay, so this person, this person, okay, whoever they are, it could be like there's somebody who, who they're like, they want to be free. Um, they want to be independent. And the way they look at marriage is that it's constricting. It is like in the past, um, I feel like this person still thinks of those things because maybe I don't know what type of a commitment you think or lifestyle you think Aries maybe you guys have to have a talk about this but what I'm seeing here is that this person um really has strong feelings for you and you have to paint them a picture of what it would be okay when they come back if you want them I don't know do you want them Aries okay but tell me more about this. I want to see this Wheel of Fortune and the Judgment. Yeah, this is decision. Yeah, Aries, you have a decision to make that's coming. You're going to either reject this person or you're going to choose to love them. I don't know. 
that's what I'm getting because this person is coming in. Um, I do see them reaching out to you. Um, they have a lot of passion for you. They're very attracted to you. Um, they know they've been gone, right? And um, let's see. Yeah. This person for sure is going to call you, by the way, guys. I just got a phone call, so that's confirming. They're going to text you or call you. For some of you, they're, most of you, they're, they're going to send you a message. But this person um, has changed. Something has changed in um, their status or their work, okay? So it's going to change the, their approach towards you, okay? So there is definitely some good news, Aries, that is coming your way. I feel like... This person is really um, being guided to speak to you, okay? I don't know if they're listening to their intuition. I feel like a lot of you, they're getting like signs about you or so forth. What is this about? Hmm. I feel like they're more open, okay? And we got the lovers on the bottom. I feel like this person, um, they never got as close to someone as they got with you, Aries, okay? So they feel that you both, if you um, try to add this again, that like a commit, they will consider a commitment. I'm just, I'm just going to put it that way, okay? Because their mind is so, like, kind of restricted against, you know, I don't blame people because their traditional marriage that most people are in is, like, you know, not what people want, okay? So, oh, okay, I just heard the the... The marriages that their buddies are in are, like, really sad or they're, like, you know, disappointing or whatever. And that's really, like, made this person have the mentality of, like, not being in a marriage, okay? But you, like I said, Aries, you can give this person another picture of what you want and why it wouldn't be that way. If that is your truth, right? So I do see someone who is um, coming towards you and they want something deeper than what you had before, okay? They want to talk about it. They're willing to hear you out is what I'm getting, yeah. <laughs> because... They want to um, release whatever it is that is keeping you both together. It's like this person just want they want to be close to you, Aries, okay? And so I think that when this conversation comes up, like I said, paint them a picture of what you think that is, if that, that's what you want. You want the commitment, you want the domestication, Whatever it is, however it is you want it, paint the picture, the marriage, the partnership, paint the picture. It is, that's what Spirit's saying in this, okay? Um, anything else, Spirit? I mean, this is a lot. This is very straightforward. Yeah. Ace of Cups. They want healing. They want peace. They want your forgiveness. They're sorry that, I just heard they're sorry they didn't make it sooner. All right, Aries. 
I hope that this has helped. If it has, don't forget to like this video and let me know in the comments how you resonate. I wish you all the best, Aries. Peace out.